Hi, Leo. It's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. Um, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what's going on for my Leos. Okay, we got the Four of Wands and the King of Wands coming out. All right, so you could be dealing with a Cancer, a Cancer male. This could be you, the King of Wands, also the Four of Wands. Something about home, rooted, you know, being rooted and grounded or having a home or something stable. Maybe even eloping or getting married. Um, someone could want to marry you. Someone sees you as the ideal partner. Someone wants to do the right thing by you and the children or you and a child. Let's see what the advice is. Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles. Someone could want to marry you, okay? Want to make the relationship more committed. Uh, however that looks. They, they want to be devoted, uh, dedicated to you, the connection, to seeing it through. It says that a relationship could have, this is also Gemini, it could have gotten a bit stale, maybe even boring. But it just says inject a little fun into the relationship. You know, um, you don't have to throw the relationship away, but just have a date night, do something. Um, but do know that this person is dedicated, devoted, um, stuck on you, wanting the relationship, wanting the commitment. Uh, the eight of swords here. Uh, but definitely Gemini energy here. But somebody's all up in their mind, all up in their head about, you know, uh, will I be trapped? Do I want to be trapped? Is this a trap? Um how will I get out of this negative swirling thoughts maybe about commitment, knowing that they want to do it, but at the same time, they're also thinking about the adverse, what could happen, what could not happen. The outcome here. What is the outcome here? What is the outcome? What is the outcome? What's the outcome? And what's the outcome? The page of wands, so something's going to happen rather quickly, okay? There could be a message. Um, there could be a proposal of some sort. Um, there could be maybe a younger child involved in this with the page of wands. Um, there could be, you know, a very romantic night, you know, that you and someone else has. There could be, somebody could want reconciliation here with you. They want to be more stable or this is you, uh, Leo. Somebody feels like somebody is highly immature. They're too, ex you know, they're too much in the energy of wanting to explore. They're not grounded or enough. Somebody is always concerned about maybe looking the part but not being the part. Somebody feels maybe even claustrophobic or stuck or, or like this relationship is clingy or they're going to be stuck to it. What's the outcome here? The two of wands, definitely, maybe there's like, um, somebody is definitely of two minds about something. <clears throat> they think negatively about one way, about maybe changing their whole life. They're not, they're not sure if the grass is greener on the other side. The cards say that, they, that it is, somebody is weary of making a decision because they don't want to make the wrong decision or a karmic decision where they have to learn a lesson. They have to work their way out of it. So somebody is at a place of, could definitely be dealing with maybe, um, an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, somebody who is very logical, practical, maybe even strategic, methodical, someone who maybe was living life alone for a very long time and now they're in the feelings of wanting to maybe be in a committed relationship. This could be same sex also. Somebody feels like somebody's too focused on, they're not well enough into, I don't know, into their financial capacity, career. Someone wants someone to have growth or grow. Somebody's looking at both options, the tried and the true or the spontaneous fun one, being married, being single. This is what I have for you. Leo, if it resonates for you, go over to the website and book your own reading there. Let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section also. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking again. Um, do check me out on keen.com. Yep, you can talk to me for 10 minutes 
$1.99 for 10 minutes on Keen.com. We could chat for 10 whole minutes. Yep. $1.99. And catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you, Leo. Many blessings to you. Take care.